So ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our Dasamsha video of the week and today we're going to be covering Scorpio Ascendant in your Dasamsha chart as in what happens when you have a Scorpio Ascendant rising in your D10 Dasamsha and as all this if you do not know if you have this particular placement you know how your planetary placements are in Dasamsha along with your birth chart and all the astrological details Check out the links here, check out my full philosophical report, including my books, consultations, and link to my academy, Maghavedic Astrology Academy, where I am currently teaching planets through nakshatras and ascendant through nakshatras. So, um, let's start with Scorpio Ascendant in Dasamsha. So, when you have a Scorpio ascendant in the Tasamsha, uh, one thing you will notice, most definitely one has to deal with major karmas in their career and in their obligation to society. One has to go through many ups and downs, many transformations before they can come up and make it. Like such people will have to deal with the lowest of the low and the highest of the high. But they are going to deal with the lowest of the low first. And especially such people, when it comes to the obligation to the society, somehow, some way, there is going to be involvement with unaccounted wealth, hidden wealth, secret dealings. Such people will have to gain and attain secret information through which they're going to be able to rise or at least transform their situation. It's always going to be this way. Even if you have somebody who you consider to be very positive, innocent and good. However, they're still in order for them to rise. They're going to have to t deal with some secret, uh, you know, contracts, which nobody can ever know before they can rise. And one of the most important things is this. Birth of children becomes very important for their fame and for them to attain authority in this life. And, and, and remember, this is especially true with the Dasamsha. Like if you have this in the birth chart, you may not really require it. But see, why is it that every, what is it that everybody wants, including me? We want success, right? We want material success so we can sustain our life and even enjoy it. Okay. And that's exactly what the Samsha shows. If not children, they must support a group of children in their life. They must donate to, you know, uh, or give their, if they can give their time, they must, uh, if they can give their money, they must give their time in helping children, opening something up for children. And one of the things you will see is that such people usually always become the most excellent vocalists and speakers. And such people have tremendous amount of wisdom. And it's, it's not even um, what they're communicating. It's how they're communicating. Because due to the transformation, the ups and downs in their life that they have seen, even at an early age, they will gather, gather the most wisdom to give advice to people. And specifically, they will regardless of the transformation and this is something also another addition a guru is very important a spiritual guru is very important for scorpio and dasamsha because that will help them to accumulate wealth and money and this is regardless of your religion so even if you're a muslim you gotta find an imam that you can take blessings from that you can learn something positive from if you're Jewish, have a rabbi that you can support. If there's some struggling rabbi, go give them money. Say, hey, I want you to, I want you to take care of yourself. You know, um, once you do this, 
this will also bring a major transformation in your life. And usually also you will see with Scorpio, Lagna, sexual relationships will connect you with your success. Like, you know, and we hear the stories all the time where even in the movies you'll have dialogues like this person, you know, slept their way to the top. You will hear in, you know, news shows, you will hear in regular TV shows. Why? Because probably if you accumulate that data of people who did that, I don't know how many people will admit that, you will see this theme playing out of this ascendant in their life. Because what happens is, let's say, even if you slept with a co-worker, that co-worker may give you some information about certain company, some information about a project that is being made. And you're like, hey, maybe I should jump on this product. Maybe I should jump on this project. And when you do, you tend to prevail. But one of the things these people are excellent at is last minute negotiations and contract dealings. And one big thing you will also see, whenever Scorpio Dasamsha people have plumbing issues, in their home, their career goes complete haywire and ups and ups and downs. And if you have experienced this, please do let me know, because I am still actually collecting data for this. That when they have plumbing issues, definitely it'll affect somehow their fame, recognition, or health, where their career may not be able to, you know, sustain itself, or they may take a break. The other thing we also see with the Scorpio Ascendant is your spouse will have some of the best um, ideas for you in terms of making money. And the thing is, even if you don't like your spouse, you think they're doing all kinds of shenanigans, even then at least their advice regarding your career will pan out like you know there are couples who get divorced after 10 years however the person who became successful they became successful because their spouse advised them to do something and they gained success now fine things went haywire behind the scenes that's okay and also you will see these people become extremely interested in politics um, after 40th year, either it'll be the 40th year or it will be the 34th year. There's this natural love for fighting for some cause and some right. And you will see a Scorpio person, their ups and downs in life, it can happen through some boss not liking you, some manager not liking you, but it's not really that. It is actually their own self undoing. It's only their self undoing. Because especially with the Scorpion, the Samsha, I have seen a lot of addiction issues. Whether it's alcohol, drugs, I have seen those things. And specifically, Anytime a Scorpio person, actually one point in their life, they will support a foreign individual. They will have a great sisterly or brotherly connection with a foreign individual. But the thing is, the main theme that you want to understand about uh, this ascendant is transformation and changes. And usually this is why I advise if you have this particular ascendant and you're in a job scenario always pick a job where projects change continuously so if you're working at something for one month you would be working at something completely different the next month and one of the best example that I've even given previously would be um, places like you know McKinsey and Company Bain and Company Corn Ferry any of these consulting firms where one month you're working with a toy company, the next month you're working with a banking uh, industry, 
A month after that, you may work with some sports media company. So what's happening is, is that there's transformation within the job that happens. But for this particular individual, it helps them sustain because transformation is going to come. Whether you like it or not, it's going to come. But the way to kind of get around it is to be at a place that actually does bring transformation. You're not stuck at that one simple IT job all your throughout the year or throughout the decade. That's not going to work because I 100 percent I've seen so many of those ups and downs when person has just this one career. The one place that these people actually can thrive is obviously business. And um, especially entrepreneurship business and consulting firms. This is where they can find success, where things change. But one thing I will also say that after the age of 42, actually 48, this effect of entire assumption neutralizes. After 48, the individual naturally has this calm and peace in their uh, professional life or even in the life that the public sees. Okay. Now, like I said, just because you have a Scorpio sun doesn't mean that you will go into a cult or you will go into being a surgeon or being some doctor. You can you can be anything. You can be a plumber. But actually, I've seen I have charts of plumbers with Scorpio and Dasamsha. And I already talked to you about Scorp uh, the plumbing issue anyway. OK, so guys, this is my analysis of uh, Scorpius and the Samsung chart. If you're new to my channel, subscribe below and hit the bell button so you don't miss these type of videos. And if you want to know where your particular, uh, you know, ascendant is in the Samsung, all your astrological details, check out the links here. Otherwise, uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.